We're now proud to have uh, reached an ad referendum agreement with the Parliament uh, on the distribution of fruit and vegetables, bananas and milk in educational establishments. We all realise that the pig meat market is very difficult and has been for a while. We are bringing in new measures, uh, particularly a, a new uh, aids to private storage scheme which will be effective from the 4th, 4th of January 2016. In relation to the Russian ban on pig meat and the negotiations that was that were mentioned uh, during the course of the meeting about uh, trying to reopen opportunities for pygmy with Russia, we are seeking on fi fifth quarter cuts, that is, lards, fats and offals, to see can we make progress. We have asked the Russian authorities to come back with proposals uh, of how we can actually make uh, the pygmy fifth quarter cuts available, uh, but we haven't uh, got any particular communication from them uh, in, the, in the last week in this respect, and hopefully it will come in due course. I am pleased to be able to announce to you that a very valid and well-balanced agreement has been reached on fishing opportunities. The agreement produced by the Luxembourg Presidency working together with the European Commission is important not only for the sustainability of stocks but for the fisheries economy of the relevant countries. Europe has started out in 2010-9 with only five TACs at uh, maximum sustainable yield. And today we are at 36 MSY tax in the North Sea, the Atlantic, and the Baltic Sea. We are on track in our sustainability targets, and the limits that we set today will give us a foundation for the coming two years. We committed to measures that will be effective enough for CBAS in an attempt to reverse the steep decline of this stock. Our responsibility to our citizens and to the sector is to deliver on the objectives and ambitions of the common fisheries policy. And today we have made yet another important step in that direction.